Ben, we're so happy that you're here. Thank you for having me this month. Tell me when you were diagnosed with Parkinson's disease. Actually, it was 10 years ago this month, and uh, years old. I was diagnosed uh, March 13, 2003. I was the age of 47 years old. I was working as an attorney in Baltimore. Musician. Uh, I, uh, I'm a scout leader. I'm a uh, uh, musician in a local jazz band. And, uh, what do you play? I've tried to continue it's all that for the last 10 years. Yeah. Like yeah. Despite <laughs> Dr. Tumor, what do you play? I play trombone. <laughs> okay. And it's, it's got quite a vibrato, right. I might say. <laughs> Dr. Tumor, too much what I can do. I actually maintain. Okay. It's all right, so how are you doing? Well, I'm doing as well as I can do. I'm actually maintaining. Extreme. It's, it's been a progression. Be well I'm on medication. It's increased um, to um, quite an extreme at this point. I'm doing pretty well today. I'm fatigued. It's an hour by hour things condition. Uh, sometimes um, I'm fatigued, I sometimes I'm unable to lift things, I'm unable to swallow, beyond. Uh, I, have, I have difficulty uh, in symptoms in, in some of those areas. So it's progressed beyond uh, the initial so uh, symptoms, which were um, essentially issues, tremor uh, and, uh, and also rigidity, um, balance issues. And, Unlike some um, other and, and other issues like that, that it I did first manifest itself with uh, problems. Unlike some other Parkinson's individuals, deep depression. I didn't suffer well. the emotional and uh, problems that they've had. Some have had deep depression had issues had as well. This has had a major impact not only on your life, but your family's life. This has had a major impact not only on your life, but your family's life. I marry somebody. My, uh, my wife is dependent. Although she, I don't want to call her my caregiver, but I certainly don't marry somebody that you schedule her want to be dependent upon. She's gone to great extent to modify her schedule and her abilities to to be on the call if there's a problem for me getting from place to place from appointment to appointment. I have a vigorous uh, schedule for exercise and, and maintenance um, because I'm proactive in terms of my care. Um, I'm still on my own vocabulary. And my children, um, now they've had to deal with it as well. They've had to learn a whole new vocabulary. And they're now in one's in college, one's in high school, so they're doing very well. You know, they're self sufficient. The month of April is Parkinson's Awareness. Month. What very well. do you want? Uh, want the month of April is disorder. Parkinson's well, Awareness Month. What do you want people to know about this disorder? Well, I want them to know, that, that, they 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 like me, well, they know that it's important that they get out there in their communities because there's people well. like me it's not just there. Over 50. Uh, young young more, people, it's an early onset disease as well. It's not just people over 50 I've met anymore. We've discovered more and more people as early as age 25 that I've met. That have a good Contributing diagnosis with Parkinson's, just as I have been. and it affects their and, um, in the community. These, these are our friends, contributors to this community, just as I have been. Classmates, and uh, we these are our friends, our relatives, our assistance the classmates. Uh, awareness Month, I'm and these are people out, that need this help to assist the community. For Parkinson's um, Awareness Month, I would ask you get out there and participate in research if you can. There's a number of community walks in April. It's a nice time of year. To get out and walk in the parks. I know there's a big open up in New York. There's some in the local communities. Check out that There's also some yeah, yeah, Make sure that there's research dollars. Army the NIH has a tremendous uh, program. They're doing cutting edge research. The Army is doing it for veterans as well. We're coming back from the war with Parkinson's.